that one takes two turns and keeps the health, like the damage it's lost, but then gains seven power. Interesting. All right, that's the thing for dupes. I don't think I have any dupes. That's items, I'm full on items. So let's go to over the left path. Reginald? <laughs> Wait. Did I put Reginald in the game or was he already in the game? I don't even remember making a Reginald. <laughs> Zandri, thank you for the raid. Muggly Douglas, by the love you, Reginald, Esquire the Fourth, that's the Johnson Fans Novels the Third. Welcome to you, Zandri, and your dear viewers to the lab. Hope you enjoy your stay. Entertainment is on the way. Crank up the speakers, don't touch the baker's giveaways every week. Please take a seat, but you'll only need the edge. Mm. You made him. I don't think I did. I don't think I did. Touch of death. I made I made casual, I made a mucklet card. Uh I made Esquire, I think. I don't know. I th yeah, yeah, I think he was a card already in the game. That's just eerie. Uh Touch of Death. Okay, yeah, I'll, we'll get Reginald. What is this game about? What's up, Xandri? Basically, we're playing cards against this spooky guy. And uh, he cheats, and occasionally you can cheat. And you can walk around the room and mess with stuff in here. And uh, when you lose, you get trapped in a card. And then... a. You play again, but then each time you play, you're a new victim. But you find the cards from your previous playthroughs and uh, mess with it. So it's like a roguelike, but there's a per there's an ongoing story through all the stuff at the same time. And it's kind of like Undertale and Slay the Spire, and it, it's been pretty enthralling so far. Alright, so sacrifice a card for a blessing. <laughs> Let's see, two of the cards are talking right now. Um... I, I really love- I, yo, okay, the rabbit pelt? You sheepishly offered the pelt to the Bone Lord. He was displeased. You received nothing. Oh, god, great. Okay, so I- I- nothing. Alright. I didn't know you could displease the Bone Lord. What is this? Squirrel. A lucky draw. Yup. All right, what is he about to do? He's about to put a Rattler on the second row. Um, the Rattler would kill this. Uh, huh. All right, we'll draw a squirrel, slam that down, sacrifice it to play this, and then use that to kill the rattler. <laughs> he dies. Uh, draw... Hey, it's Reginald! Okay, we've got three bones. We could play either of these. Let's save Reginald because it's got death touch in case something really big plays. We'll do stink bug there. Stink bug will kill the adder and then tentacle thing will go face. Okay. The mirror thing. Uh, all right. Oh no, I don't have enough. I need one more bone. Crap, that's actually not good. So I'll take three, and then stink bug will go straight across. Oh, the stink bug's uh, <laughs> stinky is going to debuff the adder, and then the adder won't be able to attack, and then he'll die on the next turn, so that's good. I question what bug did to the stink bug to make that horrifying. Ring song, the stink bug and the uh, stoat card have been slowly changing over time, and I don't know if they're, like, resembling their victims. The stoat is looking like a cell phone. I, I don't know what's going on there. Uh, okay, draw this. I think you got me this time. Yeah, no, I'm not, I'm not accepting the surrender. Uh, do that. Put that down, that mirrors that. If you do overkill damage, you, um... You get like their you get teeth which uh are helpful later on. 
Okay, we got one. All right. Uh, let's see. We have room for no. I think we. I think we're full on items, right? We got scissors, knife, and the hook. Yeah, we're full on items. Okay, so we could go over there and do a challenge. Go there and get a random card. I think it. I think the play is card campfire mini boss. That's my current cards. Um, maybe another adder. Of course, now I can't go to the dupe guy. The warm light of the campfire was a welcome sight. The tin hung rise around to dampen the greeting, warm a creature by the fire, and enhance its power. <laughs> this guy's become a 2-3 for one blood. I could make it a 3-3. Three, three. I could buff Reginald. The adders do one hit KOs. They don't need more power. It's above the turtle. I love turtles. Push your luck? No. They're gonna eat my turtle if I push my luck. If you put them by the fire, if you if you leave them by the fire buffing them too long, I'm thinking that those people will eat it, but I'm too scared to try. Great draw. All right, there's a stump in the way, two flying bees. I don't have enough bones or blood to play anything on turn one. That is not a good start. All right, so I can do squirrel, squirrel, and then sacrifice both of them for an adder. And then I've got two bones, and I can throw a stink bug down. Uh, so that mantis... Actually, that's not too bad. The bee will go down, and stink will reduce its power to zero. The mantis will go down, and hit him, he'll be at one, and then hit me for one. And then the bee will hit me, so I'll take two. Am I at two life or three right now? Uh, do I have three bones? No, okay. So draw. Okay. Okay, that makes even more breathing room. All right. Um, draw a squirrel. So that'll be hit, hit. And then beehive, and I'll take one from the bee. And I'll be at one life, I think. I could just body block that until I have more breathing room. And I'm getting I'm getting bones when that happens. Man, the stink bug is the perfect counter to these creatures, because even though he puts down a new card and they hit first, the stink reduces their power and they can't do anything. Okay, so what do we got? Uh, bullfrog is in the way. Uh, draw this. Okay, so we killed his beehive and got a free bee. So we could do bee there to kill that. And then Reginald there to kill that. Wait. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, okay, hold on. I just got a new grasp on the rules. 
Alright, so this isn't like Magic the Gathering where a flyer blocks another flyer. Flyer basically just means unblockable unless they have blocks flying. They're just going to ignore each other and fly past each other. That is not what I thought was going to happen. I'm glad I was not at one life. Okay. Divers are immune to almost everything. Stinky might help versus divers. But yeah, it's kind of a bother. Alright, I'm not in danger, but uh... Yeah, that is not what I thought was going to happen. Interesting. I wonder if he... I'm assuming he's going to run out of bees at some point. Oh, there we go. That's a good one. Um, Alright, squirrel, and then sacrifices. This tentacle thing has power equal to the cards in your hand. Nice top deck. There's the stoat that's looking like a cell phone for some reason. Alright, there's that. The Tragic Rat King. When their tangled bodies become corpses, you will gain four bones. The Pernicious Vulture, a tyrant of the skies. 3-3 three, three flying for eight bones. I've never seen that card. Try it out. New totem or gear? We have maximum equipment, so I'll go for the totem thing. The decrepit woodcarver appeared before you. She moved with a certain vigor in spite of her considerable age. Uh, I've currently got squirrels can block flying. Wait, is this squirrels are worth three blood? That would be insane. Oh my god, yo, we could be, we could do Wall of Bears, turn two. Give me that. Without another word, Woodcarver was gone. Alright, the fisherman. Alright, so he puts one of my lives out. What you first mistook for a misshapen boulder appeared to be a hulking man. You attempted to sneak past him. But your foot made contact with a metal bucket. I am the angler. You are the fish. <laughs> nice top deck. Um. How do we want to start this? <laughs> Alright, so I had a theory from last time that he steals the most recent card. So if that's the case... What I want to do is distract him with crap cards. But wait, if I play this, can he... Well, he doesn't even have to sacrifice cards, does he? So that doesn't really affect him. New fish. <laughs> Stop that. Alright, so we stole that. Alright, so that'll hit for two and end round one. Okay. 
So then he's gonna put bait on the field. And if I kill the bait, it becomes a freaking shark. Which I could kill with the mirror card. And there's a few other things I could do with it too. Um, actually, wait, could I just, I could just avoid the bait, right? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Sorry, Stone. He said, oh, come on, <laughs> and he died. <laughs> I think I win, right? Just pass? I, oh, I could have done more overkill, but yeah. Oh my god, that is so much easier when you understand how it works. <laughs> so, alright, so he always goes for the newest card. I didn't get that last time, and I was like playing squirrels and sacrificing them to summon bears, and then he would steal the bears and crap. This is much e different. Okay, you will not perish quite yet. One of these will entice you. I don't really need sacrifices that survive because of the uh, three blood squirrels, so I'm thinking pack rat. Okay, hold on. Uh, prediction. Well, I get past fish guy. Choose outcome. Yes, I did. All right. How are we doing on time? It is almost okay. I'm not gonna do another prediction. We'll get a little bit farther before I stop for lunch and then do some YouTube stuff. Moving past the pond, you took a deep breath of fresh air and continued on. Is this a blind playthrough? Yes. A moment. The relief of the fresh air quickly gave way to a bone-shaking uh, bone chill. You guessed at the path ahead as the snow increasingly obscured it. You had climbed to the snow line. Uh, I'm trying to remember all these symbols. That's cards by family. That's a random card. That's sacrifice, that's gear. I don't need gear, so we're not gonna go that way. That's buff a card, that's a fight, that's a fight. I'd probably, I, I have a killer totem. I don't think I want a totem. Um, I'm thinking go right and then left and then up and get two fire buffs on the way. A bullfrog. Okay. The crackling fire lit by the starving faces. We have not food. Uh, buff a creature's health. Buff the larva. Let's increase its chances of uh, reaching Mothman stage. No, no, we out, we out, we out, we out, we out, we out. No, 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 I'm not, I'm not risking it. Okay, so all his creatures have the ability to basically have one extra life with that lose the tail thing. Oh my god, a 3-7 on turn one, you suck. Okay, I've got an adder, that's good. Um, let's see, squirrels are worth triple. Do I have a leftover blood from that? Like in magic? Like do I have a, a mana pool? A blood pool? Okay, I guess not. Um, oh, and I didn't get an item from the pack rat because I was full. I'm a dum dum. Okay. Uh, all right. So, the pack rat is going to block the first hit of the moose buck, and then I'll use the adder to kill the moose buck. That's my objective. Alright, so I need a squirrel. Alright, sacrifice that, put the adder down. 
No, I forgot about that mechanic! No! Oh wait, it moved back. Okay, alright. You know what? That's... Alright, that's alright. That's alright. Strange larva. Uh, I don't have a sacrifice right now. Alright, so Adder will kill the moose bug. So the moose bug has used its extra life crap. Um, I have to wait a turn. Unless I use a, one of these. But I don't... I'm gonna take... No, that's a tree. <laughs> I'm gonna take tree damage. That tree's gonna fall on me. All right, I'm not gonna take any damage. I don't think so. Do this. Then the elk is gonna kill the adder, right? Yeah. That'll block that. I should take zero damage on the following turn. If I play a card here, the mole will run over to block it. But that's going to free up the elk, which will then come in and hit the boulder. Which in and of itself isn't terrible, but I don't have to do that. Power equal to the number of cards in your hand, which isn't much right now. Okay. Okay. We just pass. Okay. Um. I think we just throw that down and block. And then Mothman trucks him! Okay. And then Mothman will hit him, and he's going to slide over there. Oh no, Mothman's a flyer! I forgot I went... <laughs> I forgot Mothman flies right over the deer. Uh, okay. Alright. Uh, spooky cave challenge. Uh, totem. I'm very happy with my totems. Let's go over to the left. Oh dear, oh my gosh. Leave the bad jokes to me. Pronghorn, oh, I clicked too fast, Turkey Vulture. Kapinski, what do you do, Kapinski? Kaminsky. Uh, sharp Quills and Guardian. That's not bad. He jumps in front of an enemy and, and then hurts them when they hit him. What is this game? Inscription. It is Slay the Spire plus weird storytelling plus Undertale plus a roguelike. You're, you're in this creepy cabin with creepy dude, and you can mess with things in here. And, uh, yeah. We're playing a little game. Alright, campfire. Uh, plus two to the health of a card. <laughs> Reginald has death touch. Any Wait, what is this that says alas? What is this? Two, two. Oh, oh wait, is that the that's the stunted wolf? Why is he just an ink blot now? What the heck? Let's buff Reginald. Nope, we nope, wait, nope, no, nope, no, nope, no. Nope. I'm not risking it. I'm not taking the risk. Squirrel. Are you doing any more morning streams this week? Uh, Stormheart, it depends on how much work I get done between the end of this stream and the start of the evening stream tonight. I may need to, I may need tomorrow to get, because I've basically been like sleeping, streaming, eating, and then like, you know, dad for five minutes and then repeat for the past like four days. And I'm having a blast, but uh, I don't want my YouTube work to fall behind. So, I will let you guys know on the... The Discord is the best place to find out about that stuff. Uh, I will let you guys know if I'll be here tomorrow morning. Uh, okay, so what do we got? What's he doing? Mole is a blocker. The turkey vulture is a 3-3. Really? That costs eight bones, and you're playing at turn one. You're such a cheat. All right. I could kill it with the adder on turn two.
That's, I'm gonna take one from that, none from that. Okay, so squirrel. Wait, I forgot the squirrels are worth three blood. I'm dumb. All right, that'll kill that. If I play a card here or there, the mole will move to block it and prevent his new card from coming in. So what am I more scared of, the raven egg or the sparrow? Probably the raven egg. Wait, oh no, uh, the mole only moves to block when the, actually he'll, it'll move in a minute. When he goes to attack, it'll move. Uh, I'm at one health. Stink bug. That's actually perfect. Okay. Job Lover, thank you for the Prime. Chad, have you heard about Twitch Prime? Muckle Douglas, well, I thought it'd be original. That's why the fourth is the Johnson Festival, the third welcomes you, Job Lover, to the lab. Hope you enjoy all say entertainment is on the way. Crank up the speakers, don't touch the speakers, giveaways every week. Please take a seat, but you'll only need the edge. Hmm. Welcome. Oh, jeez. Okay, I'm almost dead. Uh, squirrel. All right, squirrel here, and strange larva. <laughs> Yup. Mothman about to smack you up! Oh my gosh, Mothman just carrying me. Uh, okay, cool. So Trapper, blah, 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 blah. Awesome. All right. Oh, what I missed up my talking about morning streams. Uh, yeah, I'm going to, like, right after this, I'm going to work on putting together a video for the, uh, like, podcast thing I did with Xandry last night, and then also doing, I gotta put the videos of uh, inscription that have happened thus far on Mucklet Place. And if I catch up on everything, I would love to do another morning stream tomorrow. Uh, but, yeah, I'll let you guys know via the Discord. So, cool. Uh, I'm gonna save here. Uh, last save 35 seconds ago. It is very, honestly, it is such peace of mind to see that. There has been a lot of variety games I've played lately where it's, you know, got an auto save feature and you're like, I hope it's saved recently and you're kind of nervous. This is very peace of mind. Uh, so start screen. We're going to play the start screen card over there. And uh, we're going to close this out for now of the, the weirdest menu I've seen. All right, chat. Y'all have been wonderful. With that, I am going to stop here for now. Uh, thank you guys for being here. This has been fun. This is the third morning stream this week. Hopefully there will be more, but 